First Person Singular. The views expressed in this piece are those of the author. Margie Kern Marshall recalls how it was all mixed up in the 50s. I like to say that I'm from a mixed marriage. My father was an atheist and my mom was agnostic. They sent me to Hebrew school when I was 11. After two sessions, I begged to quit. We also went to a Seder once. I didn't like the food, and the ceremony was long and tedious. There were so many mixed messages. In the holiday season, we celebrated Christmas, but weren't allowed to have a tree. Sometimes we observed the Hanukkah rituals, and I was all for that. My folks persuaded my brother Jim and me to stay home from school on the Jewish holidays. We were all for that, too. It was the 50s, only a decade since the Holocaust, and Jews, even the non-religious ones, were concerned with survival of their heritage after the loss of so many. During my dating years, my parents always asked, Is he Jewish? I would protest against this obnoxious question, and an intellectual discussion would ensue. They would say how they were protecting me from heartache and humiliation. I accuse them of being from an outdated generation of thinking. The stalemate lasted, and I continued dating whomever I wanted. When my brother became a Mormon, the focus shifted. Margie Kern Marshall is a retired educator and longtime resident of Santa Cruz. If you have an opinion or a story you'd like to share, send a 240-word piece to First Person Singular at ksqd.org. For First Person Singular, this is Lori Korn.